Here the question is, you are testing a machine that scores exam papers and assigns grades. Based on the score achieved, the grades are as follows. Here we have range and corresponding ratings. If you apply boundary value analysis, how many test cases will you need to achieve minimum test coverage? And these are the options. Now let's draw the boundary value analysis diagram. As per the question, the first range is from 1 to 49. Corresponding grade is F. From this we get two boundaries, 1 and 49, and F is the grade. Next range is from 50 to 59, and corresponding grade is D-. From this we get the next boundary, which is 59 and D- is the grade. Next range is from 60 to 69, and corresponding grade is D. From this we get the next boundary, which is 69, and D is the grade. Likewise, we have to cover all the range. If we do so, we will get all these boundaries. There are seven boundaries. Now, as per the question, we have to find how many test cases will you need to achieve minimum test coverage. What we need to know here is to cover one boundary, we need two values. So, for seven boundaries, we need 14 test cases. Therefore, option D is the answer.